day to everyone so today i'll be reviewing uh, these two books they are both from barnes and noble leatherbound collection uh, and both are uh, basically fairy tales as you can see this fairy tales from around the world this irish uh, treasury of irish fairy and folk tales so let's start off with this one this arrived just today uh, got it from infibeam for for uh, 1201 which is a very good price in my opinion I, I had uh, previously got it from Amazon but uh, the seller sa shipped only one book out of the two uh, which I ordered so I returned that got the full refund and uh, bought this instead and this was cheaper so uh, this as you can see is in a golden uh, golden uh, golden accented and the silver uh, linings as well and uh, with a green background treasury of Irish fairy in folktales the spines is the same thing and um, this uh, this would remind you of I, I guess uh, the Irish highlands and leprechauns green leprechauns opening it up um, the front has uh, the the picture of a, um, a forest with uh, fairies here uh, at the lower at the bottom part and uh, opening um, treasure of Irish fairy in folk tales so the contents has uh, as I checked it it has um, the it had the content is divided into various parts this the first part starts with the trooping fairies and then there's the solitary fairies ghosts witches and fairy doctors uh, okay, I have no idea how to pronounce this exactly, but I think it's Tier Nan Oge. Priests and Saints, The Devil, Giants, Rocks and Stones, Treasure Legends, Legends of the Western Islands, Kings, Queens, Princess, Earls, and Robbers. And then it goes on to the introduction. It has a note on the text. And. Uh, as I as I noted, uh, this has no uh, illustrations, but uh, each part, the chapter, uh, each part of the thing. Uh, for example, changelings has this insignia, and uh, every different part has a different insignia, as I uh, noted. For example. Um, Uh, here in, in case of the Mero has uh, this insignia this I think uh, does focus well it's a round insignia while I, whereas the next section is I think solitary witches where's the leprechaun um, let's see, yeah solitary fairies yes the solitary fairies has this one I don't know whether uh, they have any special significance or not, but I I do hope they do. And uh, the edges are golden, gilded edges, and uh, the bookmark is soft gold. Yeah, it's not exactly yellow. It's not exactly gold either. Soft gold. I think it it signifies leprechaun gold, which is a very nice touch. And. Uh, the back has, as I said that, and let's check the back. Okay, there's a there's a picture of a fairy here, and that's about it. Moving on to the next book, that's also that is also uh, fairy tales, but it's fairy tales from around the world. I got it delivered a few days back. It's by Andrew Lang. I think the stories are compiled by Andrew Lang. So this opens up into a very nice illustration of. Um, I guess ferns and uh, there are owls on the top this reminds me of uh, the uh, movie Song of the Sea I don't know if you watched it but it's a very nice movie and so uh, in the content section it's, it's also divided from the blue fairy book, red fairy book, green fairy book and then on it goes uh, yellow, pink, grey, violet, crimson brown, orange, olive and the lilac fairy book. 
so I think uh, they are um, fairy books from different from different parts of the world this has illustrations as you can see here there are quite a few illustrations throughout the book every few pages has one so compared to the uh, treasure of Irish fairy and folk tales this is much more lively it has also a golden gilded um, edges and the <coughs> uh, bookmark ribbon here is blue it's dark blue navy blue the back has the same illustration of owls and uh, a forest fawn forest and uh, let's say there the illustration the fairies go off with the farmer's wife I have no idea what this story is fairy nurse um, but well I <coughs> intend to read it so there you go fairy tales from around the world it's this looks very nice and it has the customary Barnes & Noble leather bound um, feel to it fox leather mm. the accent is red and blue and a bit of gold it says once upon a time at the back and that's about it, it gives a feeling of anticipation so yeah there we have it two books one of which arrived today and the other was delivered before the treasury of irish fairy and folk tales and uh, fairy tales from around the world so i hope you have enjoyed watching this video as much as i uh, had while making it and um, if you have any questions or suggestions feel free to comment in the uh, comment section below and uh, thank you for watching this video happy reading